so cute. <laughs> Hi everyone! It's nice to meet you. My name is Alicia. For those of you who have known me previously, I'm sure you've noticed the rebrand. Ooh, um, it's been a long while since I've put out any content, uh, so this is a little nerve-wracking. But yeah, I kind of went on a very long hiatus. I've been just busy with life and stuff, and I decided to go back to school, and there's so many things that have kind of changed. I decided that I wanted to vlog today because it's kind of like a day that marks like some change for me. So as you can see, I recently rearranged all my furniture, uh, bought some pieces like the coffee table here. Um, I finally bought my plant a new like pot, <laughs> um, which is long overdue. It's been sitting in like the pot and like paper wrapper that it came in from two years ago. Um, I bought a carpet and stuff too, so I kind of made my house more of a home which is what I've been wanting to do for the past two years and never have. Also, doing something big. I'm going to be chopping off a lot of my hair. Um, and so I feel like that was, that's a good like turning point for me to start something new and that something new is vlogging. My goal is to do like maybe one vlog a week for a year because that sounds pretty cool to just videograph an entire year's worth of just my life so that's my goal but we're gonna see how that goes um currently school it's kind of hectic it's a little busy so i'm hoping that doesn't get too in the way of everything so yeah i am excited and nervous and looking forward to this journey and i hope that you're excited about it too so here is my bunny benji I'm sure many of you already know the boys. Look at extra fluffy today. Look at him. I got him this bunny tree and he loves to climb on it. Adventurous little one. Then moving over, I have Hugo. <laughs> He's kind of hiding here. My sweet boy. Hello. This is our baby Hugo. He's first born. Hi. He unfortunately has become very sick, um, which has been very sad, but I know it's a normal part of life. Um, but yeah, he's, he's an old man now, and so he's sick, he's got a head tilt, and he's on a lot of medication, and I'm just trying to enjoy every day with him. Bam! So there's Hugo. Hey! What are you doing? Yeah, you! Okay, so before I forget, this is my hair now. It's very long. Please ignore the mess everywhere. <laughs> I'm still slowly redecorating. It's quite long. It goes to like almost my waist. I can basically just reach back and touch it easily. And hopefully after this haircut, I won't be able to do this. After all the bleaching from being a bleach blonde, I think this is much needed to just get rid of a bunch of the damage that I had done. The more I like know that I'm going to cut it, the more I enjoy the length that it's at right now. It took me about three years to grow it to this. So, it'll grow back. So, I just finished up work right now. I am going to head over to the salon now and Oh my, it's gonna be so short. I'm excited and nervous and I don't even know what to feel right now. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Alright, 
right, so here's my hair right now. And how much are we going to cut for now? We're going to start about there. Okay, and then we're gonna color it and then chop off more. Yes. <laughs> All right, let's see how this goes. <laughs> thing that I want to note about these capes is that they have like little like armholes in them and I love that because usually capes like you would just like stick it out the side but this one actually has armholes so that just makes me like so happy for no reason <laughs> isn't that cute my hair looks so dark right now I'm home. It's been like 10 hours since I first filmed this morning. And the day's done. My hair, I'm so happy with it. I'm actually so happy with how my hair turned out. I feel like I'm very picky when you sit in the chair. Um, and I know like getting a single color, like tone color and then a cut isn't like anything that sounds really like technically difficult but sometimes the simple things are more difficult. So like the cut could have been like shorter and like just looked kind of jank, could have been like that awkward length, but I feel like she cut it so perfectly. And like, I don't know, just like the layers, everything she like asked for and like the color looks so good. Like I'm so happy right now. Um, and that is like something that doesn't happen often when I leave like the chair. Um, so I'm, I'm feeling good right now. I'm feeling myself. I like this cut. Um, I feel like it works really well for me personally. I don't know, let me know what you think. Maybe you prefer the long hair. I'm sure some people will prefer the long hair. Um, it'll grow back. <laughs> I plan on growing it back out again. I'm happy right now. I'm liking this. It's like, feels like a new era. Feels like a good reset, but yeah, I'm happy. Um, I hope this vlog turned out really nicely and that you guys enjoyed what you were watching. Um, I know it was kind of all over the place. I am trying to figure out my own niche, what I'm kind of looking for. Um, as you guys know, as a streamer, I was very all over the place too. Sometimes I did gaming streams, sometimes I did baking streams, sometimes I just did just chatting slash IRL, whatever you want to call it. My thought is it's probably going to be more lifestyle, so that leaves it very generic. Um, I'm hoping to do kind of more like cooking, baking stuff because personally, I, I really enjoy cooking. I don't really make a lot of food, but I enjoy cooking. Um, and as you know, I enjoy baking. I don't really consider myself much of a baker anymore, to be honest, as much as I use the title as much as I can. I feel like I'm not really much of a baker. Uh, I'm out of practice, and so a lot of my stuff tends to go a little downhill. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm excited for this journey and what's gonna end up happening and what I'm going to bring for you guys and what you guys are looking forward from me. Huge shout out to Mari's World, by the way. Um, if you guys know Mari, she's one of my college friends and she's actually one of the big inspirations as to why I started vlogging um, because she has been at it for like a full year now. Congratulations, by the way. And just watching her content and seeing that she's able to balance school and creating all this content, like it really inspired me. And so I feel like she's killing it. I'm gonna try to do it too. And even if I fail, at least I tried. And it's something that I've been thinking about for so long. So I just may as well do it. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I will see you guys next time and we'll see what kind of content I put out and what I'm able to 
think of and all that stuff and hopefully it's fun and entertaining for you all and if not let me know if it's not entertaining okay the more feedback the better um and yeah i'm excited see you guys soon bye <laughs>